All right, so Z, no weather moldings. They never finished the car. Let's see how much water got in. Uh, she's dry, no water got in. This is in a door. Half the car is in the car. It's a really big fucking mess. The, um, the, the antenna's not back in yet. You can't see it right now because it rained. But the paint job has, uh, let's see, where is it? Some of this is not water. Hey, let's move this away. That's overspray from the paint job from the clear coat. All right, if I move my hand, you said a raindrop stays there. That's overspray. Still have the wipers off, badges off. They had the well back the exhaust on yesterday. I bought a brand new tail light. They put in the old tail light that's cracked. Uh, two wrong tail lights. This is the 2000, uh, maybe four or five version, that's the LED, versus the stock one, and uh, I got my work cut out for me, the inside part for the vent is not in yet, yesterday the rad was loose and the, the radiator cap was off, so everything spewed in the car, so that's where it's at right now. Well, the Z is here. I'm gonna start working on it and uh, rip out the seats and put in the black, uh, the black stock ones in until I fix these up. I have. Let me put this light on here. This is some grid um, eBay shopper, of course. <laughs> so these are some uh, LED shop lights put in for my dad. <laughs> They're pretty damn bright because it's daytime outside and. I don't know what lumens they are, but whatever, for four they were sixty-eight dollars. So back to it now you can see what's going on. I'm gonna move this armrest upholstery I had a long time ago. I bought this. As you can see how faded it was. That probably looks horrible. But you know what? I'm not gonna I'll change one side and see how it looks. The other side looks fine, so I'm not gonna bother with it. I cannot find grey. It's always black or orange for this for this car. Uh, if not, I get it, have to do the vinyl myself. But for now, I just wanted to get going because this is really, really fucked. Um, I went to, what's it called? AutoZone Rotors. All four rotors will cost me about $200. I'm going to get on eBay. It'll cost me about $100 with pads. 110 with pads. Um, I'll put the stock wheels back on. The amp and everything's disconnected in the back. Uh, literally all the parts are over there in those bags. So I'm putting back the weather stripping uh, and, and get this car uh, back together and eventually sell it. I mean, probably do a track there so we can sell it. Unlike my Civic that hasn't sold it either. So. Uh, the bodywork is okay. I mean, it's not perfect, but I get what you pay for, and uh, whatever. It's drivable, and it's better than where it was. So, I can't complain. But, uh, I'm gonna get this done, and i uh, get back to you guys, and see a somewhat better looking car than it is right now. Alright. On the way to get the chair. So, of course, uh, most people already know what's going on anyway. Taking out the four bolts, got all the harnesses below. I um, just take out the bolts first, right before disconnecting the negative of the battery. <laughs> well, people say the, uh, the sensors might go off and you might get an airbag light, so I disconnected the negative. You never know, I might still get the damn thing. Um, but before you disconnect the battery, move it forward, move it back, take out the four bolts, and then disconnect the battery so then you can lift up the chair and start taking out the harnesses. I just gotta figure out how to take out this uh, 
yellow clip right here. I'll be back. All right, I'm back. Uh, inside the clip has a little tab. And focus. See a little tab in there? Press down the tab. And it will come out. Focus. All right. Two hands. <laughs> Alright, so just in case someone goes out and gets aggravated and almost breaks your clip. So now you know. And now I'll this chair. Alright, chair is out. I'm going to scrub the hell out of that carpet. I have some carpet cleaner. I'll vacuum it up, scrub it. There's the chair. That chair has both of them. They're intermittent. This one would not go forward most of the time. And I believe that one would never go back most of the time. And and tilt, tilt the head. Uh, uh, like just you know, move the head, the headrest back and forth, and whatever. It, it gets stuck all the time. But uh, I'll keep on going. I'll be back. All right, other chair is out. Not bad. Actually, it's not hard at all. I think I found out what the problem is for the driver's seat. It's Canadians. See that TD Bank pen? First they invade the U.S. banks. Now they invade Nissan seats and whatever this crap is and a nickel. But that's mostly what was causing this one to jam up. I think this chair literally was the uh, the switch is probably going bad. Uh, some crap in here, like maybe some ketchup packets. But. They're out. They're disgusting. And I will get the cleaning. Oh, well, this is non-Z related. But this is one crazy cat. Just chilling in the rain. What are you doing, cat? What are you doing? Ah, shit, he's running. Recording. Let me do a mic check because it's so windy. <clears throat> mic check, mic check. Does this thing hear me okay? Or am I just talking to myself like a dickhead? Using a fuzzy ass mic. Alright. One is vacuumed. Uh, the other is next. Well, hope you can hear me using this, uh, Gay ass fuzzy mic. I just gotta put it somewhere out the way. But hopefully, you can hear me. I am going to uh, scrub the carpet and some area. Yeah, I know it's carpet cleaner, but literally had one that had vinyl cleaner, all multi purpose. But it just wants to get rid of odors, I'll get rid of it. And also, it doesn't smell, but um, I took out all the floor mats and I threw it on top of the other cars. I mean, that's what they're good for, to hold floor mats. That's, that's what old Z's are meant for, not for anything else. And uh, I'll clean this up and see. It's not going to do much. You're not going to be able to see it. It's just going to be clean for me and smells good for me. You know, that new car smell. That rain is coming down. This stuff smells good. It does have that new kind of car smell going on. And let that sit. It is filthy in there. You can see the, the brown is coming up from it. It is pouring out, man. I don't know. I'll just keep on going. I'll go to the other side and uh, wipe all this excess off. At least it'll smell nice in here because when you put the windows up, it has like. The car's been sitting for two years, like literally. Like, uh, 16 or 2015. It's been sitting for a while. Um, I didn't even think it was that long. So, should smell still so starting to have an old French fry in there that probably caused it. You never know. All right, the first seat is in. It's not perfect, but it's good. I mean, uh, I spent uh, less than $200 for these two seats. I mean, they're the manual seats, but there's no tears. They weren't stained. Um, the only thing is, you know, you can't, you can only use, uh, I didn't look at it, you can only use the uh, one harness in there. 
a small little clip. I guess that's probably just to at least have your seatbelt on or something. But uh, let's see if I'm gonna have any problems with that. But it goes in, bolts in correctly, and I'm glad, you know. I, I can't deal with a power seat keeps on failing on me. So I'll move on to the next. Uh, and also, if you could smell this thing, it smells good. That, that turtle wax floor cleaner is amazing. It really smells good in here. I had to, had to let's put it on the seats for the hell of it. Alright, I'll be back. Okay, this time I took off the actual light on the camera. I feel like it was too bright at times, but um, those are the seats. And yeah, it looks like it's brown dirt, but that's actually orange. I, I never really I don't know, paid attention to it, but it's slight orange in the seats. Uh, it's pretty cool. They're very clean. Go off the other side, and this way this thing doesn't look as bad now. Ha ha! It doesn't. Maybe I will use the armrest. Uh, I'm still debating. Next, I got well, not this I gotta work on. I'm gonna just change the wheels, put the stocks back on. I need to work on that because my radio's not working. Um, yeah, that's it. You know, I'm gonna, you know what, I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna put it on and see if there's any problems with the uh, airbag light. I have one airbag light because of the crash sensor is missing from the front. Uh, I gotta find plastic pieces for that. It's very windy, so I hope this fuzzy microphone is doing its job. The crash sensor is missing. It'll be right there. So that's why it's, you're gonna see one airbag light, but I know which one I'm looking for. Uh, this car needs a lot of cleaning, a lot of work. Uh, let me come back with the key and start it up. Alright, I'm back in the car. Let's make sure I'm neutral. It smells really good in here, feels nice and clean in here. And let's see. And I definitely need to fix that, uh, I don't know if I have a problem with a cat or something. No, nope. so that, that light was there before, that flashing one, that's from the crash, front crash sensor. Uh, uh, let's try to get the door. Oh, maybe it's a trunk. It's probably the trunk. <laughs> let's see the seat belt. All right, so the seat belt piece works. Yeah, it's, yeah, I don't know you get here. You probably definitely hear the hole in the exhaust or something. Radio doesn't work because that big amp is missing in the back. That cigarette's burned been here since 2007 or before. And uh, shift boot is probably gonna get changed. Very beat up. If I do go with the orange parts, I'm not sure I will. I will probably get the uh, well a new black boot and probably the orange shifter. But besides that, car is nice and clean, and I'm happy. Because that shit is disgusting Ooh, and it hurts my arm, my elbow. Alright, time to put on the wheels. But it is pouring rain and windy. Oh well. So, where are we at now? Uh, I'm gonna put the stocks back on. Those rims this is how it looks when it's brand new. I have these pairs sitting around forever. But, uh,. When they're new, they look amazing. When they're old, they look like shit. But uh, I like the stocks. You probably can't hear me because the wind is blowing all crazy. Let me wheel this in. That's what my brother does. He wheels around. Alright. So, as you can see, these stock Z wheels will look just right. Nice and clean. I like the stock look. Yeah. Too busy, nice and simple, and let's get started. Alright. Well, I'm gonna take a break in a few. Let's try this again. I hit the wrong button. Alright, I'm gonna take a break in a few, but i uh, show how it looks. I think it looks good. That's just me. Um, uh, eventually, with the rotors, I'm gonna spray the caliper silver. Get, well, not rotors, I mean, get new rotors, change uh, the brake calipers, silver, I'm hungry, just in case I'm slurring and stuff. Put a little antenna on, so we got wheels, I sprayed some engine degreaser in that engine bay, I found the other plastic piece, I put it on, wind is still heavy, I'm going to probably roll the car a little bit into the rain, like the engine bay, just like a little mist, I don't want to soak it with water, 
but I do want it to get a little bit misted in there, let it mix, and I'll use the air compressor and pull out the stuff, but I don't want to run water in that motor. I know it's not meant for that shit, but... Alright, I'm going to get some food. I'll be back. Alright guys, moment of truth. Let's have spray in. Alright. I need some more water. I got this hose, I got this phone with the cord, with the microphone, and I'm trying to move it around, but let's, I'll keep on spraying and see what happens. down and get back to work all right time to see foam the motor I got the brake booster hose off I see foam and my cup I'll be right back all right I got my microphone so we got my microphone back on I'm gonna pour, pour it into the cup now oh jeez I guess that, that's how it is this up. I got a half a cup in here. I'm going to try and suck it up slowly. All right, here we go. That is all of it. Close this back up. And shut the car off. Ooh, she sounds like crap. Oh, come on, I can't even get to the damn key. Can fell down again. Alright, so I sucked it all up. Let it sit for like 15, 20 minutes. I got other stuff to do anyway. And then I will come back to uh, start up and I'll find the air leak in the exhaust, hopefully with old smoke. I think the Y pipe is busted. So I'll find out where it's uh where it's leaking from and see what I need to buy. Alright, I'm gonna start it up and see where this uh exhaust leak is at. Let's see if the sea foam does a lot of mess. Oh yeah Sea foam power. That must be a leak. Ah, uh, you Y pipe. It's the Y pipe. I thought it was the cats. So that's good. I don't have to worry about that too much. Change all that anyway. Cool. Let me, let me 
didn't put the flashlight on. All right, that should help a little bit. So we got a lot of work to do under here. That's a lot of sea foam going on. All right. So at least I know now. All right, guys, I'm done for today. Let me get back up. All right, so engine's clean. Brother smoked out from all the sea foam.